Hello, welcome to the Ingredient Channel, where I recreate and share authentic Chinese recipes every week. In this short video, I'm introducing another traditional Chinese cooking technique, the red cook, or hong shao in Chinese. Pork belly is the most well-known ingredient to be red cooked. Red cooked dish carries the unique sweetness. Like many Chinese famous recipes, there is no strict standard for the red braised pork belly recipe. People add their own twists, including adding eggs, tofu to enhance the flavor. For the recipe you are about to watch, I added the potato, which ended up equally delicious. Before you get started, please remember to subscribe, like, comment, and share the video. First, pick two pounds of pork belly, skin on. In terms of choosing the perfect pork belly, besides avoiding the hairy skin, my standard is the more layer, the better. Cut the pork belly into two centimeter wide stripe, then cut into two centimeter by two centimeter cubes. Do not cut through the skin to make it a lot easier to flip when we sear the pork belly later. Then cut the potato into one inch long blocks. Keep the potato chunks larger than the pork belly cubes so that the potato does not get smashed after the long braising. I also recommend red potato as they are low in starch, high in moisture, and hold their shape well when cooked. Cut the scallion into long slices and uh, slice the ginger roots as well. In a heated pan, let's sear the pork belly. If the pork belly does not have much fat like mine, add some cooking oil. Medium heat, sear and brown one side first. Then flip to sear the other side. Until both sides are well seared, add about two tablespoons of rock candy Brown sugar works too. I ended up taking the pork belly out first due to the limited size of the pot just so that I can stir the rock candy easily to let it melt. Until the sugar turns light brown, add the boiling water, about one cup first. Mix well until you see the small bubbles, then add another cup of boiling water. Put the seared pork belly back into the pot. Three to four dried red chili peppers, scallion, ginger root, one star anise, two dried bay leaves. one tablespoon of sweet bean paste. An Amazon link is shared in the description for your information. One tablespoon of light soy sauce one teaspoon of dark soy sauce, and two tablespoons of cooking wine. Cut 
cover the lid. Medium heat, breeze for 30 minutes. Meanwhile, let's prepare for the potato. In a heated pan, add two tablespoons of cooking oil. Make sure your pan is hot and the oil is cold. Then add the potato chunks. Do not move. Let the potato to fry for about three minutes on medium heat. Flip, beautiful brown. Fry the other side. And take out. Wait until the pork belly is braised for 30 minutes. Add the fried potato chunks. High heat, braise for another 20 minutes. In the middle, you may need to flip the ingredients. 20 minutes later, pick out the spices while the sauce is being condensed. Then, turn off the heat, time to serve. Both the pork belly and the potato are super flavorful. In my opinion, the potato is even more delicious. What do you think? By the way, rice is the best companion for this dish. Well, I hope you enjoy this episode. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thank you for your support, and I'll see you around.